Please! You must help! Traveler, please. Have you heard tidings of the Edrald family? I've just come from their manor, and they're gone! Just gone! I've just arrived from Wayrest. Preparations are underway for my Arlie and I to be married. When I returned, the estates were deserted. Her family, the servant, gone! I don't know what could have happened to them. No, I don't. Arlie's parents have owned this estate since before I was born. We were to be wed here, but a month from now. I know that Rivenspire has bigger problems right now, but... This is my future. Will you help me look for them? Thank you. I'm fairly competent with a dueling blade, but I'm out of my element here. Let's start at the manor house. There has to be some clue there. Not much to say, really. I was in Wayrest, sealing writs and appropriating documents in preparation for the wedding. To come back only to find my beloved missing. It's most disheartening. The Lady Arlie Edrold, of the Westmark Edrolds. A storied family of some means. Arlie's granddam was a powerful mage, you see. Her adventures took her all over Tamriel. We were betrothed when we were children. And this has been my home ever since. Quiet is the grave. Wherever they are, they're not here. Doki was causing her worry. The servant? My word! We should search her quarters. Perhaps something there will hint at what happened. Stendhal's mercy. Better have left some clue. This might be it. This seems to be Dolky's diary. She was concerned. She writes about Arlie's sad smiles. Missing me, no doubt. She brought Arlie flowers, and then they went to the windmill. Oh dear. Well, it's just that the windmill is our spot. Me and Arlie's. It's where we went to, you know, rendezvous. So why would she take Dulky there? It doesn't make any sense. Uh, not much. Not about that, anyway. Wait, they saw the Baroness hide something away at the windmill. It doesn't say what. Traveler, the Baroness never goes out there. Why would she hide something? Nothing. Nothing. But I'm shaking like a leaf. Here, take it away from me. Let's go. Let's check out the windmill. children, Arlie and I are here to get away from the world, what I wouldn't give to have her with us now.
told her mother. Then it's true. It's all true. That's the key to the Undercroft. That must have been what the Baron has hid here. Why? We should investigate. Undercroft, steal yourself. We don't know what's down there. Stendar's mercy. What is that? Are you seeing this? the eight. When we found the portal closed, I feared the worst. A little tired, but unhurt. Dolky and I managed to overpower our captors. Mother and father, they're still trapped. I'm afraid to ask, but would you be willing to look for them? Frederick brought you, didn't he? I knew he'd not forget me, but I worried. Dolky, will you go with our new friend? I need a moment with Frederick. Oh, I knew he wouldn't abandon me. Thank you for coming. If we get through this, we will be in your debt. During the night, there was a crash, and then... And these terrible creatures crawled up out of the basement. Father, he tried to fight them off, but they overwhelmed him. They caught us and dragged us here, to this awful place. No, but there are ruins everywhere. Maybe near one of those? I, I, I'm sorry, but I, I'm not sure. Let's get moving. Be safe. I don't know how much help I'll need. Lead the way. Look, it was nothing. We grew up together. With Federick so near, she never... She could never see me for anything other than a playmate. When he left, I thought... I had a chance. You've seen her. Oh, she's... And very kind. Years ago, she took in a wolf she found wandering the mountains. He was badly hurt, anyone could see. But she did everything she could. When he died, I'd have given anything to make it right. I don't know. I asked her once. But it made her sad, so I stopped asking. With Federer gone to Wayrest, we had more time together than ever. I think, in time, I might have stood a chance. Mother would never have it. She did all this. She made a pact with Daedra just to stop me from getting close to Arlie. I know she didn't mean for all this to happen, but. You are surely one of the Aedra, sent by Stendar himself. 
<laughs> but that's silly, of course. Was... was it Frederick who brought you? I I'm worried he'd forgotten me. Please, my friend. If anyone can save Arlie's mother and father, it's you. My wife, my daughter. I don't know who you are, stranger, but thank you. Be careful. These Daedra, they, they're animals. Have you seen my Arlie? Oh, thank Julianos. I should have never gone into the Undercroft. I should have never taken that key. Ask Dolky. None of this would have happened if she... If she... But it doesn't matter now. I just want Arlie to be happy again. Is that so wrong? You're right. I should have listened to Alan. He said we should just wait it out. He was right. One last thing. The Daedric Lord here, Valark, has a relic called a Sigil Stone. It's attuned to our manor in Rivenspire. If it isn't destroyed, she... She could come through at any time. Please, promise me you'll destroy it. Thank you. Julianos guide you in your quest. My friend, you are truly a hero worthy of song. I can't begin to express the depth of my thanks. You've done so much for me already. Might I ask your advice? My future. As we've walked together, I've come to see how small my life really is. If you hadn't come along, my dearest Arlie and her family would be dead. And perhaps myself as well. I feel... Perhaps I should strike out on my own. Become like you? You are right. Of course. Had I not left, none of this would ever have happened. There is something to be said for strength of arms. But it is not to be my lot in life. Such an awful place. I could have lived my entire life without knowing of such things.
everything goes back to the way it was? I don't know how I feel about that. Federic's back, and Arlie, she really does care for him. Seeing the look on her face as he stepped through that portal. Look, I'm just a servant. If me being around causes problems for her, maybe I shouldn't stay. I will, and when, if I return, it will be as an orc who has struck her name into the face of the world. Thank you, my friend, for inspiring me. Before you go, Arlie wants to speak with you. She's waiting just outside. Thanks again, friend. We never would have made it out of there without you. I know you were only thinking of me, Mother, but I sometimes wonder about your temper. Oh, our Savior, thank you again for everything you've done. Only to say that without you, none of this would have been possible. My father, my mother, Dulki, maybe even Federic. We would all be dead right now. If you ever have need of a home, please, you will be welcome here. These last few days have taught me anything. It's that I must learn to stand on my own. I... I think I understand. But Dulki, you will always have a place here. Baroness, I know you're angry with me, but I have always thought of you as a mother, and I will try to do you proud. Dulki, I may have... overreacted. Know that I am sorry for what happened. I should have listened to Alan. Take care of yourselves. I will write when I can. We'll miss you. And I... you. I am sorry to see Dulki go, but it really is for the best. Soon my Arlie will be happily married and we can all get on with our lives. I'll miss Dulki. She was a good friend. <laughs> 